In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly make your Twitch highlights and videos into GIFs or GIFs or graphical interchange format files, whatever. Let's get right into it. Recently, I've been using GIFs in things like tweets and embedding them on my website, and I wanted to share how I make them quickly. For stuff that I want to make directly from my Twitch stream, the easiest way to do this is first make a video highlight. Now, I typically like to make my highlights under five minutes, and the goal for our GIF is going to be to make it 15 seconds or under. Now, with that in mind, let's download a Twitch highlight. So to do this, let's go to nightdev.com slash twitchdown. Click connect with Twitch and log in via the Twitch API. Now, just click the highlights tab, then select the highlight you'd like to use and hit download. It might take a little bit for the video to process and then actually download, but once you're able to grab the full video, we can then convert it into a GIF. Our next step will be to log into Jiffy.com. A link will be in the description below. There's actually a couple of really great sites that do similar things like this one, but right now this is sort of my go-to for this sort of process. Signing up for an account is recommended, but not required. Having an account will help you quickly get access to your old creations. Now, all we need to do is click the create button and then simply drag our highlight video onto the page to upload it. Once it's uploaded, use the start time slider to select where you want your GIF to begin and then use the duration slider to select how long you'd like it to last for. If you'd like, you can add caption, select a caption style and even add color to that. Also, you can use tags to categorize your GIF as well. Once everything is entered in correctly, hit create GIF. After the file processes, you will now be able to share via social networks and get code to embed into a web page. However, I like to click the advanced tab and download my GIF by clicking the download button. This will allow me to directly upload the file where it's needed. As I mentioned before, there's a lot of sites out there that follow a similar process. So this process will pretty much work for any of those. If you'd like to search Google for online GIF maker or something like that, and I'm sure you'll find a bunch. But you can also leave in the comments below which site that you prefer or even a link to your first creation. If you like this video, please give it a like. And if you really like the video, make sure to subscribe for more from Nerd or Die. Thanks for watching.